Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for October 30th, 2020. So today we have communication is key, new moon in Gemini. Now this, we've been talking on and on and on about truth, okay, about speaking your truth, but you got to understand your own truth before you can get it out there. And truth isn't a one-time thing. <laughs> so people are like, oh yeah, I spoke my truth one time. I was done. That was it. I don't ever have to do it again. No, no, no. You're always growing and developing and, you know, enriching your life through discovery, through self-discovery. Yes. As your soul starts to go through all of its lessons, as you go on your soul's contract, more and more things are going to start coming up for you. So communication is key. This might be talking out a situation. I'm grabbing a cabochon here. Might be talking out a situation, but really guys, I feel like this is you. You got to be honest with yourself. Okay. There is something that's not working for you and it's time to understand that. So here's the cabochon and this is, oh, it's Gabriel again. We had Gabriel a couple of days ago. I don't know how these big ones fit in here. Hey, I might be onto something with this mini candle. What's up? <laughs> All right. So we have Gabriel here again. Gabriel is again about communication. Yes, he uh, helps with the throat chakra and the sacral chakra. Uh, Gabriel is supposed to be in charge of writing, communicating your truth lovingly, setting boundaries in that way. So if you need help doing this, definitely be working with Archangel Gabriel today. And this could also be communication with the other side. We are in that time of year, <laughs> right? We're in that time of year, the veil is very thin. And so if you want to communicate with a loved one, so some of you are, so we've had a lot of loss this year, a lot. And some of you are reeling from tragedies that you've experienced in 2020. If you want to communicate with somebody on the other side, you can certainly do that. Not everybody is going to pick up on it, you know, the way some people can, but you can definitely feel in your heart. There's always, <laughs> there's always a, a receiving mode in the heart. So maybe you don't hear the person, but you can feel, you can feel their presence in your heart. So Archangel Gabriel, if you want to work with Archangel Gabriel, Gabriel can help you do that. Um, but make sure you're not doing it. Cause I have people who come to me for personal readings and they just want to keep, uh, going through me to communicate with somebody on the other side. And here's, what's interesting about that. Instead of learning to feel that person in their heart, they just keep coming back and saying, what do they have to say now? What do they have to say now? What do they have to say now? And sometimes it's not in the other soul's best interest to keep coming in. You know, they don't stop existing. <laughs> Some of us who are sensitive, we know that to be a truth. Whether more logistical people want to roll their eyes at that or not. We've seen it. Okay. We know it. We understand it. So they have their thing that they need to do on the other side. However, if, you know, especially in 2020 here, if you have experienced some bit of traumatic event or God forbid, if you lost somebody this year and you want to talk to them, you can please be grounded in doing this. Please make sure you are protected. And my goodness, please, please, please make sure you are doing it for the right reasons. Intention is everything. Do not be messing with divination tools that you don't know what to do with. You know what I'm talking about. I won't even say it. If there's something that comes up. Everyone thinks it's cute. And it's a game to play around Halloween. Don't do it. All right. You're opening portals. And if you're not ready to handle that, don't be messing with it. Okay. So keep it angelic, y'all. All right. I'm sending y'all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.